tell me the story of this place. Where does this come from? Okay, we, we start to develop the vertical fields because you know, most of the people come to live in the cities and you don't have place, but you have a lot of walls. And if you, win, if you want to bring back the nature to the cities, we can do it only on the walls. What kind of response have you had to this idea? You know, <laughs> I'm smiling because when you speak about plants, people are smiling, you know, people are seeking, people, in the past people will live, will live near the nature. Now they're living, you know, in the big blocks, in the, all the concrete, and they want the green. You can feed cities without all the transportation. If you do the agriculture inside the cities, it's also bring the green, it's clean the air, you know, it's a win-win. It's not just agriculture. In the city, it's a lot of things, you know, it's to make the city more green, more beautiful, with a lot of plants, also to grow food. You can clean the air through the, the, the plants. So tell me, how does this work? The method is to grow on soil. It's not hydroponics. You grow on soil because of all the amazing things that the, the soil gives to the plant. So uh, the technique is actually a method to hold the soil on the wall. There's a specific angle that, the, that holds the soil in this position. And then we, we can grow our plants first, uh, first on tables. And then when they're ready, when they're big enough and strong enough, we can put them vertically. The idea is to, to start to build the big ones because for the small wall or for the small scale project, we have a lot of projects. But in this year, we are focusing in the large scale project, in a big project. How big is big? I do not know. 10,000 square meter wall, a 50 story building covered with plants. All the ideas and all the answers are in the plants. You can, you can watch the nature and understand what happened.